So you're thinking about LPT and you're wondering, what is this brokerage all about? Is it gonna allow me to kind of elevate my career in real estate? What sort of commission structure, what sort of training? What is it that's kind of this special sauce that may help me get to my next level of career? Well, in this video, we're gonna go over exactly that and break down the information that you need to know so that you can make the correct decision moving forward. So stick around. <music> What's up everybody? This is Tim Whittemore with the Whittemore Group right here in LPT Realty here on the Emerald Coast of Florida. If this is your first uh, time to our channel. We do tons and tons of different videos about helping you in your career and also about evaluating uh, brokerages as they come along. <laughs> now I've been through it all. I've been the single agent. I've been a buyer's agent, team agent, ops manager. I've done real estate in several states and I've made a ton of mistakes. <laughs> so please learn vicariously through me so you do not have to make those same mistakes. They say that you're the sum of five people that you surround yourself with. Let me be one of those voices to help you get to the next stage of success of your career. But let's go ahead and break down LPT Realty and talk about the commission structure and the training. As of now, we are in about midway through 2023 and LPT has been one of the fastest growing brokerages in the United States, surpassing EXP. Um, <clears throat> when we look at this brokerage, one of the, the key things that people are interested in is the fees or rather lack of fees. Uh, there's no sign up fee for those newer agents or even those that had a team like mine and looking to bring them over. Uh, there's no monthly fees either. So you don't have to worry about dishing out money if nothing's coming in, especially when you change over brokerages. There are a couple of fees though. You do have a one, one time per year annual fee of $500. But the interesting part about that is that's not gonna come out of anything until you start doing business with LPT. So once you have that first closing, that $500 annually will come out and you won't have to, that won't be due until your anniversary uh, month of the following year. You also have a $195 transaction fee, yes. So what you'll be able to do is every single transaction, you'll charge that fee to your buyer or the seller, and that's just an additional fee that they do to you know keep the lights on, so to speak. Uh, however, that uh, transaction fee, depending upon your state, you can usually have the buyer pay for those, um, but I would check with state compliance to see how that goes. All right, so there are two different tracks when it comes to being an agent at LPT. You've got a business builder and you also have a rev share partner. Now as a business builder, it's basically like being a 100% cap agent, right? You're gonna pay $500 per file up until about 5,000, so that's 10 transactions. Then after that, it's 100% of the transactions back to you. Kinda cool, right? Uh, you also have the rev share partner. If you're familiar with the other places like Real, EXP, uh, places like that, they have a rev share model. Well, LPT has this too. You can either be a business builder or a rev share. So what's a rev share look like? It's an 80-20 split with the, with the brokerage where 80% is going back to you until you give them $15,000 per year and then you're capped and 100% goes back to you. Now, if you are going to be a team lead, you have to be a rev share partner. Um, but other than that, you can stick as a business builder. Now, one of the things that people like about the rev share, in addition to having access to that, is the stock. So you get stock as well on your first, your third, 10th, and 35th transaction per your anniversary year. Now, this is given in shares, not in dollar amount, which is pretty cool since at the time of this video, it, uh, this, this company hasn't gone public yet, so we have no idea what that's going to look like, right? Um, and if they go public and it goes from, you know, a penny stock to a dollar, that's just life-changing, right? Um, which is the reason I brought my team over uh, to have that. Now know that if you're a business builder, you don't get as much stock as you do as a rev share partner. So maybe that will equate into your decision whether or not to go there or not. Now for the rev share, if you're familiar with how rev share works, basically if you bring somebody on and they're in your downline, 
depending upon if they're directly under you or that they've hired somebody and hired to hired, those are your downlines that continue to go. Now, most of the rev share I've seen go down to about seven levels, right? So level one is your primary, then that person, hire somebody that's number two, and so on and so forth, if you get my drift. And uh, interesting enough, a lot of the different people that have the rev shares, they they usually go out to like somebody, something crazy to get down to the seventh level, like 40 plus people in your direct line that are doing business, right? Well, at uh, LPT, it's only 15. It's only 15 people in your direct to get down seven levels, which is pretty amazing if you think about it. Uh, with this brokerage being so new, growing so fast, what a great opportunity to jump in now in order to take care of that, uh, that rev share. But Tim, what if I want to be a business builder first and then go into rev shares? That's something I could do. Absolutely, you can. So at any point, you can still put people in your downline as a business builder. And then at that point where you have enough people under there that it makes sense to be a rev share partner, you can switch over and start collecting rev share. So it's kind of cool. Like it's a little best of both worlds. And uh, some other things to concentrate on is this isn't just a commission. You get tools with this stuff too. It's an agent first uh, type brokerage where you can pick up the phone and some somebody represent a representative broker or broker associate. You'd be able to talk to somebody there at LPT to be able to help you out with whatever situation that you're with. Uh, they also give you lots of tools. So LPT is listing power tools where they give you tons and tons of marketing, print marketing at basically cost. It is you get so many pieces of marketing material just by getting a listing its own on its own, and all you have to pay for for that initial box of, of goodies <laughs> is uh, just the shipping, and it will be branded specifically to your your listing. We'll have all the, the photos that you put in there. You can also do additional digital marketing. You could do mailers. There's tons of stuff that you can do, and for a very affordable price when it comes to print marketing. Awesome, right? Uh, you'll also have Chime, our CRM Chime, or Follow Up Boss. At this time, they'll pay for either or, whatever one that you'd like. Uh, you'll also have Dot Loop is included for all your transactions and compliance, and LPT Connect, which will give you a slew of different training and different options, and ordering marketing material, and just everything just kind of central in one area. Now let's talk about that training. So training, uh, if if you're looking to get into some some training as a newer agent, there is a training leader in each state and there are live trainings that go out each week. There's always a calendar of when those live trainings are going to be and you can jump on uh, on Zoom or whatever that they're hosting it from so that you can get a live interaction on whatever that they're teaching. And there's always, always stuff going on. But not only that, but there's tons of different recorded um, on demand type training that you're going to find in the LPT Connect training where you can just come in and just absorb as much information as your brain can take and then start to try to implement that. So that's what you have. That's a basic overview for LPT. Hopefully this was uh, very useful for you. If you have any additional questions, please leave it in the comments below. Um, if one of your questions is when is it coming to my state? I don't know. <laughs> Don't know, uh, but we can keep an eye on it for you. So if that is something that you're looking for, um, if you're here in Florida with us and, and looking to join a team at LPT, of course, you can reach out to me here on the Emerald Coast uh, via phone, text, email, find me on social media, whatever you need. Uh, and if I can support you and your team coming over here and you're in a different state or something like that, I'm always happy to talk to you guys. No, no uh, problems there. I know how tough it can be <laughs> I'm doing, doing uh, several brokerages, or not brokerages, but teams in different states. Uh, so I'll, I'll be able to give you any sort of advice and everything I can for that. So uh, in any case, uh, I'm Tim Whittemore with the uh, Whittemore Group here with LPT Realty, and we'll see you in our next video. Take care. Referral marketing. Are you looking to cultivate leads from just word of mouth and how awesome you are? Well, you are in the right video. What we're going to be talking about in this specific video is about past client and SOI, that sphere of influence, referrals. And we love referrals. And we're going to talk about the 